This is Bruce Halliday. He's the general manager here at the Port Theater. This is an area that maybe the general public doesn't get to see all the time. What is it? Well, this is the very start of where this whole theater got designed from. Wow. The design started at the loading dock. And why is that so important? That's where every show comes in the door and it's where every show leaves. Okay. This is this is the efficiency maker for the whole operation. Efficiency. I like efficiency. Yeah. <laughs> now, we did show earlier the variety of productions uh, that take place here at the theater. You see all kinds of stuff on stage. Who and how is that all determined? Well, you know, it's a great question and there's a there's a hundred answers. So let me give you the first two or three. Efficiently. <laughs> <laughs> Indeed. <Okay. laughs> awesome. So uh, we have um, we uh, a big part of our operations is based around rental activity. Right. So rental activity is made up substantially of community users and commercial or corporate or for-profit organizations. The big shows. The big shows often are commercial. Right. Uh, Not-for-profit societies and community groups get a special rental rate. Nice. So right now we've built up over the years 65 to 70 percent of our shows are community users. That's impressive. It's and it's at the core of our business. And that really speaks to the vibrancy of the arts community Absolutely. here in Nanaimo. So a lot of these rentals are um, are obviously uh, dance schools, they are um, theater groups, um, music groups locally mm -hmm. and, and some of these rentals are non-performing arts. We partner with the Child Development Center, of course, and we, you know, partner with Shaw Cable yes. to bring in the telethon. So there's there's no end to the type of community partnerships and users that we can bring in here. What's the weirdest thing you've seen take place? And I know that's a oh, sort of the weirdest thing. Yeah, the craziest thing. <clears throat> well, you know, probably one of the things I'm I'm really proud of, and it's a bit crazy, is we encouraged um, the use of the theater for MMA. That's the wrestling, the mixed martial arts. Mixed martial arts. I remember that. And they've done it twice here. They've sold out each time. Brilliant, uh, non-traditional use right. of a traditional theater space. Excellent. Well, I think the message here is that the Port Theater really is for everyone. It's not pigeonholed to one type of artistic no, express expression or one type of event. Uh, speaking of expression, do you like borscht? I borscht? do like do borscht oh, very okay. much. I make a very good borscht Do you? I okay. Do. Well, you might be in the running against these people.